It's a message of uh, hope. And uh, it's a bit of two words, it's at last, at last. The cyber community is recognized as a critical community, which today is uh, in the front line, ensuring that all of us have access to uh, common goods, connectivity, internet services, for long, with the ambition forever. And finally, this community that is doing this for the common good is recognized of worth of uh, support. The world is going through a uh, non-stop series of uh, crises, uh, being uh, climate, geopolitical, conflict. So it's a very complicated situation to attract interest, to convince funders, to uh, inspire volunteers around a common cause. So it's kind of logical. Now, it doesn't mean that there's not a systemic problem that these organizations are facing. It's a strange equation, if you think about it. On one end, you have organizations which are doing good for everyone. And on the other end, there's a scarcity of funding and capacity to help them. We absolutely need to address this. And finally, we're going to put the right, um, the right data on the table, that we're going to uh, give the space to co-create solution, and that will have systemic solution. Yeah, systemic solution to help the community. Because so far, it's been a galaxy of civil society organization going for piecemeal of fundraising towards uh, more or less the same funders and trying, let's say it, to survive. I mean, the ambition that is, uh, that is there, what is at stake, should be more than survival. Uh, the internet is everywhere. It's a shared resource. Uh, we believe it has to be free, interoperable. It has to be, you know, a, a surface of growth, of freedom, of human rights. It can't be that the organization defending this needs to fight for their survival almost on a monthly basis. The risk is uh, enormous. I mean, I'm not sure it's understood. And it comes from this... Um, usual misunderstanding when it comes to cyber. It feels virtual, you know, like fluffy somewhere. No one really understands that today cyber is access to water, is access to food, is the capacity for you to do online banking, to connect with your family, to have access to education. If the entities working for the common good, defending the core of the infrastructure that is today cyber, making sure that everything works and that the lights are on, then what is at stake is indeed enormous.